Um, should we do a market update? Sure. All right. I keep having to open and close the door because my dog keeps barking and then he gets scared because he doesn't see anybody. <laughs> He's barking and gets scared of himself, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, so ooh, we have an interesting set of numbers here. Let's take a look. So new listings, 64 new listings hitting the market uh, in the last week. $353,602 is the average. Uh, $989 is the high. We'll have to take a look at that one. Um, now let's take a look at it. What do we, we got something to do? We got somewhere to be? Uh, there. Oh. Oh, I feel like I've seen this house before. Maybe not. Maybe I've driven by this house before. Yeah, yeah. This is a nice looking house. Prairie Rose. How big is it? Uh, 2,665 or 2,600 square foot. Five beds, four, three and a half baths. Cool. Um, so that's that. But check this out. Sold. 51 sold. So more hitting the market than coming off the market for the first time in a while. Usually they're either parallel or a little off average sale price 312 that's what we predicted i think because the average condition was like 320 so we predicted this number 98.07 percent negotiating and 53 days is pretty much bang on 630 high 114 low um price decrease is 47 again so th there's a lot of them i we even did one a big one the other day like thirteen thousand dollar price drop or whatever because just like wasn't wasn't the right number uh the average price of the ones dropped is 327 and look one person got an offer after dropping their price so uh it does work if you're you're wondering and, and joel's going to talk about this at the end of the show as well but um what's going on with the prices and, and what's going on with people's heads so this 47 price decrease i think that's the one that we're gonna focus more on right so uh oh coal and coal so there's 47 pending right now um that's a saw, lot that is that's pretty good 312 average so hey next week it'll be 307 that's <laughs> somewhere in that range uh minus six yeah so we'll say 306 58 days on market it's normal three and 397 so pretty standard the numbers are down a little i'd say for the sales um let's see what we got here for just Lethbridge in 12 days 67 sales mm, so that'll get us over the 150 mark but maybe not to 200 you might i don't think it's gonna be 200. that'd be crazy it'd be the first time in a while hey that it wasn't um historical sales uh this one and uh, left bridge and i gotta write down my predictions i think i said what 147 or something like that for august only there was a recording of it uh, yeah yeah i mean if you look at these 230 250 260 270 260 um i think it, it might end up right here as last year hey which is a good month like if you think about it these used to be the high months 190s and 170s so they were like that's a good month when you look back so mm -hmm. if august ends up there but then you are going to see a drop i'm sure of it it just has to drop in a little bit here um so it, it obviously year over year and month over month every month's been record breaking uh compared to its predecessors so yeah um were there any communities you wanted to specifically look at or anything uh no, no, not necessarily. It's just every, yeah, yeah. I just want to see this. Oh, okay, it's up a bit. There's only there's only 12 houses available in Copperwood. That's crazy, and one's pending. Oh, that's the one that dropped the price. Um, no, that can't be right. Maybe, I don't know, what do I know? Oh yeah, that is. That's right. Twin River Road. Yeah. Um, I think one of our guys has an offer on that one. Uh, yeah, so it's, it's crazy when you look at, if you look at, just you know um let's go riverstone um single family there's only 15 available uh when you look at paradise canyon oh i always forget how they call it paradise canyon i'm sure 11. um you know so when you're looking at the subdivisions that people like to go to um there's not a ton to choose from seven in sunridge so um that's just west side obviously if we go south side it's a little different but i'm just saying like that there uh so yeah so i mean the market is kind of sitting where it is oh actually let's check how many are active right now 521 detached homes 341 so it's still low on inventory hey i mean yeah it's not not crazy so no we're with about half half inventory 
maybe a yeah. little less than half typical inventory this time of year, which is right. better than one third. Yeah. Well, it's nice to have, I mean, if we could have 500 ish, it'd be great. Right. But it would, so it's a weird concept, but it would drop the prices a little bit to have more on should, um, but it would make it less insane where people are paying a, a crazy number. We'll talk about that at the end of the show, but yeah, it's a uh, eh, market's fine. It's just steady Eddie right now. Um, predictions for the end of the year. Do you think it's going to really tank or what do you think? No, I don't think it's going to tank. I, I like, I, I don't know. I I'm, um, I'm at a, I've been putting a lot of thought into this, but, uh, I haven't figured out, uh, any reasoning in my head that makes sense of what's, what's happening right now.